hello and welcome or welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, welcome. And if you're returning, thank you so much for coming back. I'm so happy to have you either way. Today we have two big boxes of e-nail couture scoops. I'm not sure exactly what's in here. What happened was I had made a purchase, my credit card got declined, so I made another purchase. Turns out that there was only a hold on my credit card. This happens all the time when I'm shipping to the US. And then I got an email saying that some stuff was refunded and then I got the shipping confirmation saying that all things were shipped. So I have no idea what's in here. I've never opened up one of these scoops before, but I've seen a lot of people opening them and I'm really excited to crack on it and see what we have. So we'll go one box at a time. Let's just open up this one here. How's everybody doing? I hope you're all having some really great weather. Here we're having a ton of rain, which is fine because April showers bring more flowers. So let's open this one up. Okay, so just as I thought, I'm gonna bring this down here and then uh, we can adjust the camera angles. So it looks like we have something here. So this is just like a priority mail. It doesn't say anything on here, but I think we'll figure out based off of what's inside, uh, what it could be. And then this one here actually says, so I super scoop, you can see. And then it looks like we have a little thing here, a little paper letting me know what's inside here. Oh, interesting. Oh, okay. So I wonder if this was the one that they returned because it says here that there's two super scoops and two regular scoops. So I wonder if there's like one super scoop in here and then two regular scoops in here. We're gonna open it up and we'll see what it has. Um, because I remember getting a refund for one of the super scoops. Um, so let's just see. I don't know if like I can tell or if there's going to be something inside. I don't know. Based off of all the stuff that I was seeing from other people, here's a little preview of what's inside. Uh, based off of what I was seeing from other people, it's been like a mixed bag. So it's, it's kind of hard to say. So let's just move this forwards and I'll pull things out one by one. Okay, so perfect. So it looks like we already got a few gel polishes, which is nice. I don't have literally a single thing from e -Nail Couture. So let's just see what this all is. This one looks like, it just says product of the USA. If you wanna see, I really don't know what this is. You have like the Sailor Moon thing on the top. Like I understand that their aesthetic is really like out there. Does this come off? Oh, look at that, this comes off. Um, yeah, so let's see what this is. I'm wondering like a base or a top coat. Oh, okay. This is probably like a shimmery, oh shoot, I can't find the camera. It's probably like a shimmery top coat or something. I don't know. I'll have to do another video swatching this stuff because I have so much stuff here that I don't want to take up so much time just um, just looking at. This one's probably an alcohol ink. The maxi ink set probably in like yellow, I'm guessing. If you see it's yellow. Oh shoot. I'm still getting used to this double camera setup thing, trying to be better at my cinematography here. So I hope you all appreciate it. So this one is Shiny Star Top Coat. I saw a lot of people getting this one also. Oh, okay, so this is like the uh, Robin's Egg type situation, if you can see. So that's really cool, excited to put that to good use. I was uh, thinking that I wish I had that around Easter time. It's like the perfect time to do it. So it looks like we have some stickers here, which is really nice. We have some money stickers. These would be really cool for like a Vegas set or something like that. So that's, I'm just going to throw all the garbage on the floor and I hope you enjoy how chaotic it all is. So let's just see. Sorry. I'm trying to figure out where this camera is. Okay. So these are the money stickers here. So you have some thrown money, some stacked money. Super cool. And then these ones here are very pretty. There are some like kind of fall toned um, flowers with some gold on them. So let's see what these look like. Okay. Oh my gosh. Some leaves, a lot of gold foiling, which is really nice. And got a file. I'm not sure what this is. Oh, 240, 240, which is a great size, uh, great grit for the natural nail. Looks like we got a bunch of tips. The biggest thing for me is that I need to figure out if these uh, tips are going to fit my thumb because I have really wide thumbs. Oh my gosh. Like, I wonder, is this too 
of the small scoops or is this two super scoops? Oh, it looks like I have a bit more gel. Okay, let me try to pull out all of the nail tips here. Like this thing just keeps going and going. This must be a super scoop. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Jeez. So let's see if these have, okay, so this one is sport length. One, two, three, one, two, three, go. Soft gel nail extensions. So let me see if I could see a zero. I have a gel product on my nails right now, so I won't be able to see for sure, but I'm pretty sure that zero is the smallest size and honestly, uh, the largest size, sorry. And honestly, if the zero doesn't fit, I'm gonna have to give away the majority of these. Uh, because I don't do a whole lot of press-ons, like here or there, if people ask. Oh, wow, okay. You know what? I have confidence. So if you see that my, my thumb is very wide and there's product on it, but if you can see, it's kind of hard to see because this is so clear. Like, actually way more clear than I thought it was going to be. Um, but yeah, so if you can see, it looks like it fits side to side with the gel product on. So that is very exciting. So that was the short square. Okay, and then what else do we have here? I know that some people got some like like a lot of doubles, so I'm not sure if I have that here. I'm just going to put these to the side. Okay, this next one here, this one is Sculpture Almond Medium. Why is this so difficult? Okay, yeah, Sculpture Almond Medium. So let's take out, if I could get a zero or one in this one. I would like to pick out the biggest sizes. I feel like it has the best representation. So let's check out this zero, or this one, sorry. This is a really, really good length. And it looks like these are etched. Right now, I use almost exclusively um, Opry tips, which actually Opry just had a really nice sale. I picked up some extra tips. Um, but this is a really good length to me. Is this honestly a one? Then how small is the zero? Like, look at that. It doesn't come anywhere close to covering my thumb. Anyway, whatever, but this is a nice, uh, a nice length for sure. As I mentioned, once I get these nails off, I'm going to try them on. And honestly, if they don't fit, I'll just do like a giant tip giveaway. I have so much stuff put aside for a giveaway. I'm going to have to do one soon anyway. Okay, and this next one is mini stiletto. So let's take a look at this. This does not look very mini. Like compared to the medium, let's take a look at this zero. Yeah, this zero looks gigantic. Is it really that big of a difference between the zero and the one? Okay, so this is the size of the mini stiletto, if you can see. Oh, shoot. I'll update you guys in a short in the future and let you guys know if these are fat thumb friendly because I know, I know I'm not the only one. This one doesn't even look as wide as the square, but honestly, I find that sometimes like the square in the coffin can sometimes be wider at the bottom than the um, almond or um, the almond or stiletto. So that is that. And then we have round but it doesn't say, I'm guessing this is like round long. Let's just pull one out. I'm gonna keep pulling out the zero so that I can compare them all. Okay, so this I'm guessing is the long, and this looks like this probably would fit my thumb, um, but it's a really, really good length. I don't typically use uh, round or almond. I tend to go for stiletto and then I just round out the top, just my preference for what I like my stuff to look like. And then let's go for another clear here. This is tapered coffin. All right. I love, love, love a tapered coffin. Like the Sean Legend ones from um, Opre are some of my favorite. Um, I just, I just like the look of it because I have, I feel like they're sausage fingers. People tell me that they're not sausage fingers, but I feel like they are. Um, but because I feel like I have sausage fingers, anything that makes my um, fingers appear longer, I really like. Yeah, this is very, very, very similar to the Sean Legend ones. If you can see like how high that apex is. And this is the one. It looks like it's going to fit my thumb without product. That is so nice and long. Oh my gosh, I'm really excited to do some nail art with this stuff. Okay, so let's see. We have a few more of the clear ones. And then we have some of these that we'll go look at in a second. Let's see if I have any doubles. Okay, tapered stiletto. Okay, that's interesting. I've never heard of a tapered stiletto because stiletto is kind of tapered by nature. But I don't know, we'll figure it out. 
these are really cool. I'm really, I'm really excited to see how these end up working out because as I mentioned, like I am Opry girl like through and through and um, I don't really mess around with other brands because it's like if you find what you like, like why, why shop around sometimes? Oh, okay, okay, okay. So if you can see, this is like, wow, this is like really, really super duper pointy. Okay, and it looks like this one, look, it's sticking in my finger. Looks like this one has a little bit of an apex also, if you can see, tiny one. But also I have, as I mentioned, a lot of gel product on my nails. Are you telling me that like I actually did not get any doubles? Okay, so this next one is Sport Length. I think this is what I had gotten initially. Yeah, it looks like it. Unless this might be... Yeah, yeah. So I got two Sport Lengths. So I'm going to put one aside for a giveaway. And then we have Mini Stiletto. Did I get Mini Stiletto? I'm having trouble keeping track of it all now. Round, tapered stiletto, tapered coffin... Yeah, so I did get a mini stiletto, so we'll put that in the box for a future giveaway. And then we have XXL Square. Let's take a look at these ones. Oh, XXL. This barely looks like a medium to me. All right, listen, you do you. So this is what that looks like. Put it on my thumb. So that's pretty good. We'll test those ones out. And then what are these ones? These ones are almond medium. Did I get almond medium already? I'm losing my mind here. Yeah, okay, yes. Oh, that's sculpture. Yeah, sculpture almond medium. So another one of those is in the box. And then let's see what these last two are. We have round. I think round I already got. Um, yeah, round. Okay, so put those in the giveaway box. I'm going to have a giant giveaway box. This one is round again. Um, okay, and then these ones here are Eternal Beige Almond. So let's see how these ones are. I honestly don't know how people are using these, are using them as press-ons, are using them um, in like the Gel X method, because it's my understanding that you could cure these using um, like Builder Gel or whatever it is that you're using. Um, because they're not, um, they're not completely, um, like they're a little bit jelly, if that makes sense. But this is like, this is really nice. And I would wear these on my nails alone. It's a good length for me. This is kind of like my comfort level um, of where I can function like a normal human being. Okay, and then these ones here, these are Eternal Beige All Men. So, okay, same. And then these ones are Princess Pink Coffin. All right, so let's take a look at these ones. These are so cute. Okay, so that, oh my gosh, that is what these ones look like. And then here's what it looks like in comparison to my nail length now. Pretty good, honestly, pretty good. So I'm happy with the tip selection so far. I got a few doubles, but who's complaining? Not I. Okay, so there's still so much more stuff in here. I want to try to get all of the gels out so at least we can have some sort of an organization. There's so, so, so much stuff in here. Like, I can't even believe it. Like, I'm just digging and digging and digging. That is crazy. Oh, there's more stickers, too. Oh, my God. Okay, let's move this back again. We'll throw these on the floor. So let's see these different gels here. I, okay, so this one says 001. If you can see, let me zoom this one in a little bit. Can you see that? 001. What did this one say? Oh, 003. Okay. So let's see what this one looks like. Oh, okay. So can you see that? Oh, what am I doing? You see that? That's very nice. Okay, cool. So a nice like glitter one. Okay, and then let's see this other glitter. This one is 001. So what do we have? Oh my gosh, I don't want to open this. Okay, so let's put this for a giveaway. I'm not going to throw that one. Uh, and then this one is Maxi Ink Set. I'm guessing that this one is going to be black. Best guess, right? Black, this way. Cool. Okay, and then this one here, this is a liner in 004, a beautiful purple. So that's a really nice, this could honestly use a really good stir. Cool. 
All right, and then this Shine On Top Coat, this one is Moon, and the other one that I got was Pluto. So if you wanna see Moon, and then let's see what this looks like. Oh, ooh, okay. So it's silver. Are you being serious right now? Yeah, silver. Cool. And then it looks like we have another version of gel here. This one is Galaxy Kitty, and this is a cat eye gel. So let's take a look at this one. Okay. Wow. Okay, that is super, super pretty. Really excited to use that. And then it looks like we got three of the Lux wipes. I've never used these before, but I've seen a lot of other people use them. So it's my understanding. Yeah, they're just big. I don't know if these are lint free. Seems a little ballsy to call these ones lint free because they like genuinely they look like they're made out of cotton. Um, so I don't know, but also they don't say that they're lint free. I'm not saying that they're saying that. I'm just saying I wonder if they do because there's a lot of uh, companies like the OPI ones. Oh my gosh, so many people use those, but I just find they give off so much lint. So I'll try these out and see how they are. And then it looks like we got not one, not two, but three of these candy boxes. So they're all the plastic ones. I understand that they have the uh, metal ones also, but we have three of these. I'm going to put these in the giveaway box because I have too many of those things. And then it looks like we have some extra files and then three of these brushes here. These honestly look really great. I've seen a lot of people hauling these and I've thought that they're pretty good. And I like the concept that they have this thing here. Um, I thought this would be really good for like getting under or something and then this for over. So I'm gonna have to disinfect that one. And then I'm gonna put those two in the giveaway. And then it looks like we have some monomer. I feel like somebody was telling me, yeah, this is not MMA, this is EMA. Anyway, if you want to see, there's it's not full, if you can see. It's not full, um, but yeah, if you can see the ingredients there, um, it doesn't look like it's MMA, so I'm not sure why people are saying that, um, but I'll do some more research before I do anything. And then, oh, I missed a gel. Uh, so we have this gel here. This one is number 008, super, super rich one coat. Oh, okay. Wow. Okay. This would be really great for the fall time. Yeah, really happy to use those. And then it looks like we got a whole bunch of these. A whole bunch of these guys here. So I'll open them up so that we can see. And then I'm going to put them back in and pop them in the giveaway because I have so many things like this. So if you can see this one here, it has a bunch of like gold stuff. Has probably if, if you were to flip that over i don't know if you can see but there's like a little pearly thing in there so that's super pretty and then did we get another one of the same yeah so it looks like we got two of those if i have to split this up into two giveaway winners i will and then somebody's gonna get two of something because some stuff i have three other stuff i have two so, but this is that one. If you could see the beautiful like denim blue, looks like it has, I really don't want to open this because I know that the caviar beads are going to go flying. Oh, this one here, this one you can see that gold piece that seems to be in all of them. Now watch me flip it over. I, are you kidding me? Can you see it right there? Right there. So this seems to be in all of them. So that's really cool. Um, so I'm going to pop all three of these in the giveaway pile. In the giveaway sorry in the giveaway box and then it looks like we got i think these um i think a lot of people are saying that they got these like these three in uh three these three and a file in the boxes so um i can do that that's fine and then it looks like i got a few of these bubble gum gels so three of them it looks like and they all seem to be pink did i bring my tweezers here okay so let's take a look at this these are the worst tweezers did i oh my gosh. okay so let's open this one up and we'll see what it is i think this is some sort of like a gummy 
a gummy something or another. Wow, this is tough. Am I supposed to like cut it open? Is that why? I can. I don't usually, but let's try it out. Okay, so I'm not quite sure what this is. Is this supposed to be like a poly gel, acro gel, like what? What is the situation with this? I should really look into it because this is like so, so, so thick. So I don't know. I don't know, but I will look into that in the future before I use it. And then these two I'm going to put in the giveaway pile. Okay, and then we have, I think everybody has kind of gotten this. This is the apron. I have my apron that I use already. So I'll put that in the giveaway. And then it looks like we got... It says Summer Candy SM03 and SM04. Oh my gosh, more that I have to open that way? I wish I was better prepared. If I had known, I would have been way better prepared for this. Okay, so I'm hoping... Oh, okay, okay, okay. This is, this is something different indeed. Okay, so it's like a glitter gel. Okay, cool. I should use one of these Lux wipes to clear off my knife here. These are really soft though. Okay, and then let's open up this purple one, although I assume it's going to be almost exactly the same. Yeah, almost exactly the same. All right. So that is super cool. And then let's wipe this off again. Try not to cut myself. That's always the goal, although I am rarely successful. And then it looks like we got some extra ones of the money stickers. So we'll put that in the giveaway. Extra one of these, these ones. We'll put that in the giveaway. These ones I didn't see. So it looks like we have a lot of money stickers. These ones are really pretty though, I like them. We have some butterflies, they're nice and, um, they're nice and muted. Oh, okay, so it actually has his branding here. That is super pretty. And then it looks like we got a bunch of green crystals. I got two packs and one of them is going to go in the giveaway. I didn't bring a tray here, but you can see in my hand. These are really pretty. These are kind of like those jelly stones. Super cool. And then that seems to be all that is in this box. So let's move on to this next box that says right on top, if you can see that it is a super scoop. So let's see what this one ends up being. Da, 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 da. Okay, this one I'm going to put, this is the um, apron, I'm going to put again in the giveaway box. And then, okay, so let's move this out of the way. Okay, and we'll take out all of the tips. I should put this away, I'm gonna make everything sticky. Okay, this is like definitely the super scoop because it's, it's very different from the other scoop for sure. Okay, so let's look at these tips here. Uh, this one is Sculpture Almond Medium, which I'm pretty sure I have. Okay, and then these ones here are round, which I know I have. And then this one is XXL Coffin. These ones I'm pretty sure I don't have in that pile there. But let's give her a go. I think I just have the tapered coffin. Okay, yeah, these are these are really big. Wow, okay, and this is a one. So if you can see the difference in my hand size or in my finger size. So that is that. I'm glad that I didn't get too many tips in here because I saw some people were like really overloaded with tips and it's like, sometimes there's only so much you can do. Okay, and then this one here is a mystery. This looks like the tapered coffin also. Okay, it's, it's coffin to some degree. 
And then this one is Princess Pink Coffin. And these are the ones that I had gotten before also. So put those in there. Another one of the Lux Wipes. So let's put two of these, not the one that I just opened, um, but two fresh ones in the giveaway pile. We have one of these um, puffy, these are really good for ombre. I actually have an airbrush machine that I much prefer to things like this. So I'm going to put that in the giveaway pile. Okay, and then, ooh, okay. So these are some dual forms. I recently started using dual forms um, because there's a lot of people in like uh, Russian nail art that use them. Um, so if you can see, they're just squared. And then this is, is this the biggest? This is a zero. So I'm not sure how well this is going to fit after I take the stuff off my nails, but we'll see. And I am interested to try. And then, ooh, what is this? Okay. This is the E-Nail Couture um, Armrest. I don't use an armrest, so I'm going to put that in the giveaway pile. And then I saw a lot of other people getting these, and I'm so glad that I did also. Um, it's a bunch of brushes. So let's see what kind of brushes I got. Are there any more here? Okay, so it looks like we got two acrylic brushes. This one is the 16. And it looks like it's already pinched. This is nylon, 100%. Like, it's not even trying to be um, Kalinsky. But I'll give her a go, and we'll see how it ends up working out. And then this one here is another 16. So I'll put this in the giveaway pile. And these are totally missing their tops. Do I have another top in here somewhere? I don't know. Um, but I'll put that in the giveaway pile. And then it looks like we got... A couple of regular ones. This just says Max Estrada. Okay, so this one is the ombre brush. I love a good ombre brush. People use it obviously for ombre, but I like to use it to pick up glitter. So you pick up the glitter, tap it on the nail. I'm, I'm never good at putting those, um, putting those plastic caps back on. Every time I see somebody else do it, I'm like, yo, how'd you do that? Okay, and then let's see what this one is. We'll see if it's another ombre. It is another ombre brush, as you can see, exactly the same. So we'll pop this one in the giveaway box. Okay, and then this one here, this looks to be a sticker book. Okay, I have so many sticker books, so we're going to pop this in the giveaway. I know you're wondering, why did I buy all this stuff just to give it away? If I'm being honest, I didn't mean to buy all of these many, many boxes. So now that I have them, I would rather just spread the love then keep them because I can't return them. We have another file here, another 240 file. Looks like we have some sort of a gel collection here. We have more of these um, gel paint things here. Okay, I'm just trying to take out all of the gels so that I can do something cohesive if it's possible. Okay, so let's take a look at this collection that we have here. These ones have the color on top, which I really appreciate. And okay, so it doesn't say which collection this is, but I like, like if you can hear, they're in good bottles. So let's just open them up. Okay, so this first one here, this red one is kind of red, um, is screaming fall time to me. So really, really nice, dark, burnt red. Okay, and then this one here, beautiful, glittery purple. I wonder why he has so many different bottles. Okay. And then this one here seems similar. Oh, sorry, sorry. the red one was 084. The purple was 149. And then this one here is number 79. Oh yeah, beautiful, beautiful burnt orange. Great for the fall time, although thankfully we're really far away from that. This beautiful baby pink, which is number 136. Oh yeah, oh yeah. That is just gorgeous. Okay, I wonder if I have any top coats in here. Okay, and this one is number 148. Okay, beautiful rustic, rustic bronzy gold. 
And then do we have this one? This one is Super Top Coat in Pluto. Putting that to the side. I didn't mean to put that there. These are all my things that I'm putting to the side. Okay, and then we have two liner gels. I'm really trying hard not to open the stuff that I already have so I can give it away. Okay, um, this is number eight. We're gonna give that one away. And then this is number 10. This one is either gold or yellow. Okay, a beautiful, beautiful traditional gold. This needs like a really good stir because it's like hella thick. But we'll put a little bit of acetone and we'll stir it. And then this one we already have. This is number 003. Put that one to the side. And then let's take a look at these gummy gels. What did I do with it? Oh, this one is, this doesn't say the color. Oh, this one is Autumn Candy AU02. Okay, so let's see. Oh, that's not what I was expecting at all. I was expecting something based off the top to be a lot more of like a burnt orange color. Okay. But I guess it doesn't look that badly. Okay, and this next one here is number AU01. Guessing this is gonna be kind of like a maroon color. Okay, interesting. Oh, this even has butterflies in it. Okay. Okay, so that's interesting. I'm not sure how I'm going to use these if there's like a specific way that you should be using them because man, they're thick. Um, so I'm not sure why they're in a pot or why you would use them that way, but we'll figure it out. I got this My Candy Box, another one that I didn't give away. I may need to make like a significant amount of winners here to make this all make sense. Oh my gosh, like where do I even start here? I have more monomer. I can't ship monomer, so I won't include that in giveaways. This one is Enail Couture Maxi Wet Wipes. We'll see how those are. And then this is Nail Care Brush Wipes. So let's open this up and see what these are all about. I wonder if this is something that like, I feel like people are saying that they use this when they're doing acrylic, but like, how? I'm not sure. I'm gonna have to figure out like, are these lint free? What is their situation? And then we have another one of these orange wood sticks. And then it looks like we have some acrylic. Let's see, four acrylics. And then what is this stuff here? Okay. Oh, cool. Okay. So we have Happy Extension Gel in number 106. Now, for this one, I am super intrigued. I'm making such a mess here. So Extend Gel, but in a color. Okay, all right, let's, uh... okay, so it looks like, is this like a glitter yellow? Yeah, yeah, glitter yellow or a glitter neon green. I'll probably see a lot better um, once I use it on like a big full nail. So that is that, oh, am I going to lose the lid? Of course I am, of course I am. Okay, all right, and then it looks like we got some acrylics. This one is Flash 04. It's interesting that in my other box, they gave me what felt like a lot more acrylic. And then, oh, sorry, a lot more monomer, but no acrylic. So I know I can't really see what the acrylic looks like based off of the powder. Good job, Jess. But we'll give her a go. Okay, so this is Flash 04. I'm excited to swatch that. And then we have Flash 01. So this one looks a little bit more on like the darker nude side. And then what is this one? This one is acrylic system. Okay. Oh, oh my gosh. Christmas set red. I saw a lot of people getting the Christmas set ones and I think they're so pretty because they have like a lot of stars and stuff in them. Yeah, you can see, you can see the stars and the snowflakes here. Cool. 
Okay, and then we also have glow number 24. So I'm guessing like a, like a neon yellow. Oh my gosh. All right, cool. Interested to see what this is going to look like without the, um, uh, with the monomer, but I'll swatch it another day, another time. Oh, this probably went on the back of something. Okay, and then we have some nail glue. All right, cool. And then it looks like we have a bunch of these silicone tools. These are really good for molding 3D gel, but they're also really good for chrome. And the one thing that I like to check with these is do they pop out? And these ones, you can see, they do not. Like I'm pulling really hard, if you can see. These do not come out. That has been my biggest gripe. And then as you can see, these ones, it looks like a cuticle pusher, but it's not, but it allows you to really, really get in there if you're doing like chrome powder, or these are really good for um, pressing down foils. So it looks like we have five in here and they're double-sided, which is really nice and really convenient. What the heck is this? Nail remover cotton. Okay, okay, this is awesome. Okay, so this is those things where it, usually there's monomer in them, but if there isn't, you just kind of tear it and squirt it in. Um, so it looks like we got a hundred of these. So that's really good, enough to get rid of 10 sets if you are removing all 10 fingers, or all 10 nails at once, imagine moving all 10 fingers. Okay, what is this? I think this is the Dappen dish. I've seen a lot of people, oh no, it's not. This is the finger, cu finger curing lamp. Uh, this I'm going to put in the giveaway. It's pink. I have a bunch of stuff like this. So I would rather pass it along to somebody else, especially if I'm going to be including tips. And then, oh, this is the Dappen dish. I'll open this, but I'm not going to keep it because I actually already have this exact Dappen dish in this pink. So this is what, oh, that, oh, that stinks. So this, if you can see how deep it is, these you kind of have to line up in like the perfect way, but these are really great for um, your clear acrylic or your monomer. Like it's it's big enough to use for um, your clear acrylic. Um, oh, is this is this just a giant? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw I saw a lot of people opening this. Oh, mine is purple. Oh. Okay, so this is the water bottle so you have this big straw super cool you have your um your stars in there this one says good mood okay super cool and then oh it looks like it has some i wonder why i wonder why it has these um if you can see it has a few of the um a few of these styrofoam things on the inside all right, well, I'm going to pass this one along because I'm legitimately not allowed to bring any more things like this into my house because I have a bajillion and I always drink out of the same one. So I have banned myself from owning more of these. All right, and then I have a few more things in here. And then take this whole box over there. Okay, I'm going to put those aside so that I can... Oh, okay. Oh, this is a different green. This is a lighter green. So in the last box, we got this green. And then in this box, we're getting this lighter green, which is really super great. Mind this mess here. And then these stickers I actually already have. So I'm going to put those in the giveaway pile. And then these stickers I actually already have too. Okay, so I'm going to clean this all up and then I'm going to get working on the other... Um, the other box all right so let's open up this next one here and we'll see i don't even know what the scoop situation was or what type of scoops i have in here so this is all a 
really great surprise. Oh, okay. Okay, so this one actually says on it that there's two scoops in here. So I'm guessing that's what the other one was. And then this one says super scoop and it actually has a smiley face. Oh my gosh. Okay. And, okay, I'm gonna have to deal with this one in a minute. Okay. So this one here says two scoops. So, but it says that I had gotten four scoops. So I wonder if there's like a one, two, three go scoop or like maybe that was one of the ones that got returned. As I mentioned, I had, um, I had um, a couple things get returned on me. So, okay. So the one, two, three go scoop might actually be. So quick preview for what all we have in here. Looks like we have a ton of nails and okay nail scoop okay so you see that right here interesting okay so let's take a look at all of these tips here and then we'll go over the rest there's so many repeats in here but i assume there would be okay so this one doesn't say what it is but it looks like it's a stiletto of some sort Yeah, definitely, probably that tapered stiletto. Let's open this up. Yeah, oh gosh, they're so sticky. So I'm, I'm wondering if this is the same. Yeah, this is so nice and long. This, like I see this and I think immediately um, Halloween. So I'm definitely going to be utilizing these then. All right, and then let's see what else we have. So many tips here. Uh, this one here is the round ones. And then this one here is the sport length, the one that I already have, I had already gotten. This one is another round one, like man, they're really trying to get rid of the round ones. And then this one here is eternal beige almond. Did I? I'm not sure if I got these, so I'm going to end up keeping these. And then these are the mini stiletto, another one I'm not sure if I got, but we'll open them up just in case I didn't. Oh, these are so cute. These are so tiny. Oh my gosh. It's funny that some of these seem etched and the other, out. the other ones don't. Yeah, this is tiny. Even for a one, yeah, I feel like I did already open these up. Even for a one, I feel like I said that the last time that I opened these also. And then we have another mini stiletto. And then we have Princess Pink Almond. Did I get Princess Pink Almond last time? I think I only got the, um, I think I only got the coffin last time. I don't even know. All right, so let's see if we can find a big guy here. Yeah, these are really nice and jelly looking, so you could definitely, could definitely cure through that if you can see. And this is that. These are honestly, these are really pretty. I really like these. I would wear these on their own and be super happy. And then it looks like we got another Princess Pink Almond. So we'll put this one in the giveaway pile also. And then another Princess Pink Almond. I'm sure that this is a popular style. Like this doesn't seem like something that they have to get rid of a lot. And then another sport length. And then this one here is the Eternal Beige Almond. And no, uh, yeah, okay, that one was just there. Okay, put, pop that in the giveaway pile. And then it looks like we got some foils. How many foils did we get? Oh, multiple. Multiple, multiple. All right, so let's see. Are these all different or are some of them the same? Hmm. Yeah, this one looks to be the same as that one. And then these two are different. Okay, so let's just take a look at these. I like these ones because they seem so groovy. So we have this one. This one I love so much. Nice rainbow with the, um, with the triangle. And then we have these ones. Nice cherry blossom, very holographic. This one here. A snake skin again holographic different colors this one another 
snakeskin one. Cool. And then it looks like we have some flowers on the side. These are like really groovy, very 70s style looking. Oh gosh. Oh no, 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 no. Okay. And then more flowers. Still in that like groovy style. And then these dots here. Cool. More flowers. And then more flowers. These are all full cover holographic. These are really good with a silver glitter polish underneath. So this one is going to go in the giveaway pile because it's the one that I just showed you. And then I'm pretty sure these are different. Mm, no, they're the same. They're exactly the same. Okay, so I pop this one in the giveaway. Okay, let's take a look at these. Oh, that is pretty. Oh, it looks like this looks like an eye. You see that? Okay. And then we have this one here. This one is interesting. I don't know if you can see. It has like a like a subtle cheetah pattern. Cool. And then you have this one. This one that looks like it has like a snake skin and some flowers. And then this one. Okay, this one, if you can see, it has skulls. It's really hard to see. It's like right here, skulls with uh, with flowers on them. Okay, these ones, I'm getting silver everywhere here. Okay, and then we have this. Cool. And then we have this one, this peacock looking one. This is super cool. You see that? Oh, it's like a peacock and it's like butterflies. Cool, I really like that one. Okay, and then this one looks kind of peacocky too. Interesting. All right, I'm getting silver everywhere. <laughs> I hope I'm not eating it. Okay, and then we have this one here. This one actually kind of reminds me of like the arches in the church. And the, uh, you know those windows? So that kind of reminds me of, and then this blue one here. Super cool. And then another animal print one here. Cool. All right, so let's pop that to the side. And then we got two more of these Lux wipe, Locks wipes. Oh my gosh, and then like so much. Of oh, the elusive metal My Candy box. So let's see what else is in here. I know a lot of people are saying that they hope that they got this. How does it open? Okay. Oh, right, right, right. So it has this like tray here. And oh, I'm sorry. And then you have space underneath. So a really great way to store your tools. This one has a little bit of a dent in it. Um, so just whoever gets this in the giveaway, just know that it came dented. I didn't dent it. Okay. And then... What else do we have? Oh, more stickers. Oh, okay. Oh, these are super cool. Oh my gosh, I've never seen anything like this. How often do you see something really unique? These are really cool. You see the uh, the sheen on them, that silver? That is really cool. All right. And then what else do we have here? We have a couple of files, more 240, 240 grit files. We have a couple more of these brushes here, uh, a couple more orange wood sticks, and then let's see, this nail scoop. Oh, this this is definitely the uh, one, two, three, go. Okay, and then we have two liners in 003. I don't think I had opened a 003. Yeah, no. This is so pretty. This is one of those colors. Yeah, this one needs a good stir and like some polish thinner and whatever. Um, but that is very nice. Every time I see a color like that, I just think about, um, I think about um, toenails in the summer. Okay, so it looks like we have, oh, it looks like we have another one of these stickers. I knew that that was gonna fly away. And then this, I'm guessing, I have stickers here, um, but I'm guessing that this is a nail glue. Just open it up, see how it is. Oh yeah, okay. 
All right. I'm not going to put those in a giveaway because I have no idea how they're going to transport. And then we have number 007. I'm not sure if I opened this one already. I don't think so. Not sure. But that is very pretty. Looking forward to using those. And then we have a couple gel polishes. This one is number 35. Another one, I'm not sure if I opened it. No, I don't think so. It's like a nice bronzy color. And then the next one we have looks like a straight up black. This is number 36. Oh, purple. Straight up purple, no glitter. Okay. Huh. Cool. And then this next one that we have here is Moon, which I already opened. So I'm going to put that to the side. I don't want to throw it. And then it looks like we got some more bubblegum gel in pink, some more acrylic, and some more monomer. Okay, so monomer looks the same. Looks the same. I know they have that like cotton candy one. Uh, these bubblegum pink ones. If you can see the ones that I showed you guys before. I was in the giveaway. And then Glow 06. I think I got Glow 07 before. What did I do with my tweezers? Oh, here we go. All right, so let's take a look at this. I'm guessing this is a green. This looks like a green. Okay, super cool. Nice neon style green. Are you joking? Oh no. For a split second, I thought I wasn't filming on that camera and then I was about to die. Oh, this one is neon raspberry. All right, interesting. Okay, this doesn't look neon or raspberry, but we'll have to check it with some monomer snow for sure. And then this looks like a big daddy. It says grand champion, but it doesn't have a color. All right. Hmm. I don't think this is a clear, probably a nude. I don't know. Let's watch them all another day and see for ourselves. All right, and then let's open up this one, two, three, go, which already I am regretty spaghetti uh, because I already opened up so many tips that this may have been a waste, but only a waste of $10, so we're Gucci. Okay, so this is Eternal Beige Almond, another one into the giveaway pile. Eternal Beige Almond, another one. Honestly, I'm happy to spread the love, even if this isn't ending up the way I wanted it to. Sculpture Almond Medium. I'm not sure that I got these, so let's open them up. Yeah, these ones here, these ones actually seem like they're, um, what's it called, etched. But the other ones did not. So let's see, this is the size of this one. Pretty good. And then up against my nail. Okay, cool. I probably already have these, but to be honest, I'll probably keep them because this is kind of like my jam. Okay, and then these ones are Tapered Coffin, which are the ones that I got that I said were like the Sean Legend. And then Princess Pink Coffin. I know that I got one coffin in this kind of style, but I thought it was, um, I thought it was the Eternal Beige. I'm not sure. But let's open these ones up and see what they look like. Good size, honestly, really good size. Okay, and this is honestly a great length, great, great length. And we still have another huge super scoop. This, honestly, this is too much. I wish that I hadn't gotten this many scoops because I already have a gigantic box filled with things to give away and a gigantic box filled with things to keep. So I would have been so happy if I didn't have this extra super scoop. I'm really, really happy to spread the love and give some to my nail sisters and friends. 
but um probably wouldn't be doing this all over again because like honestly people who are hauling like 10 15 20 hauls where are you putting it all tell me please all right okay so i'm pretty sure i'm going to have to put all of these in the giveaway pile because i have like looking at the box of the How many giveaways am I going to have to do? Holy guacamole! This... Is there is 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 there? I want you guys to see. Like, let me move this all out of the way. I'm sorry if I'm shaking you. I want you guys to see. How many just tips I have here? Okay, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one. Shit. Okay, listen, I'm really, really grateful. This was a really, really great deal. But I'm going to have to legitimately give all of these away. So it looks like we have a bunch of exactly the same. Holy guacamole! Okay, so all of these, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, all of these nine are sport length. Do you guys know something that I can do with this outside of making press-ons and outside of giving them away? Because, like, I'm happy to give it away, but shipping is expensive. Sometimes it gets lost, which is, like, really frustrating when it does. Um, so, please, like, let me know if there's something that I can do, like, a place that I can, like, donate some of this stuff. Oh, my God, there's a hair in here. Yeah, if there's, like, a place where I can, like, donate some of this stuff, like, do you donate this stuff to a women's shelter? Like, I don't know. Again, not not ungrateful at all. Really, really happy and excited that I had the opportunity to buy this stuff. I had the opportunity to get such a great deal um, because these were 30% off, these scoops. So, yeah, these are all the same. Wow. This is... Like, did I win the tip lottery or is this normal? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 12 of these eternal boosts. I have, the, like, that big box that I had right now full completely full okay so we have oh gosh oh gosh oh gosh okay we have another sticker book we have another one of these ombre things we have oh these are nice gel brushes let me just move this out of the way for a second okay that didn't work Okay, so let's see what this brush is. This one is another ombre brush, if you can see. And then we have this one here. I'm guessing yet another ombre brush. Okay, yet another ombre brush. Okay. And then we have a gel brush. Oh, it's stuck. Why is it stuck? Oh, I think, you know what I think happened? I think the, um, I think that whatever the thing was, the, um, the liquid that's inside, I think it's starting to come out of this one. Yeah, this one is sticky AF. Okay, that's cool. I'll just keep this one. Uh, things like this, like even if you're not using it as a gel brush, this can be really handy for like a cleanup tool. So I'm going to keep that one. I'll put the lid onto this one and this is going to go in the giveaway box. Okay, and then we have another one, which yeah, I'll put this one in the giveaway box too. It didn't seem too sticky. We have another one of these armrests, again, in the giveaway box. Another one. Oh, these dual forms I'm definitely going to keep because these are the Russian almond ones. And I've been thinking about getting these. Oh, geez, you see, I almost dropped it all. Okay, so these are the Russian almond ones. If you can see the tip of these. And then this, yeah, these are going to fit me. 
you can see the length, super cool. So, those garbage. Oh, I knew that wouldn't happen. Okay, and then we have more of these nail care brush wipes. We have more of the Moxie wet wipes. We have more of the nail remover. This one is sealed, so I'll put it away. Another one of the glass uh, dappin dishes, but this one isn't clear. I have it in pink and in clear, so I'm gonna give it away. This one, is this one of those curing lamps? Another one of those curing lamps. Okay. And then a whole bunch more of the, this might be the whole collection of the autumn candy ones. I opened up the other ones, but I don't wanna open these ones up. Um, so I, I don't think I have this orange one and this clear one, but I definitely have this like browny one, this like maroony one, but I'm going to put that in the giveaway pile. Uh, we have a whole bunch more of these five piece, 10 sided silicone tools. Okay, and then it looks like we have another one of those. Is this green? <gasps> a green one. Okay, so same sort of deal where you have the um, rainbow. It says good mood. Let's see if this one has. Let's see if this one has. Yeah. Okay, cool. So this one's really cool. Again, not allowed to have these in my house anymore because I don't have a place to keep them. So pop this one in the giveaway pile, but we're not going to throw it so that we don't crack it. And then it looks like we have some more gels. Okay, so did I have this one? I feel like I had number 148. I'll open it anyway, and then if I do have it, yeah, this one I do have. This was that like bronzy one that I got, I think, from like my first first scoop. Okay, and then we have this nudie one here, number 96. Oh yeah, this one's really pretty. Really, really, really pretty for this time of year. And this one just screams Christmas to me. This one is number 130. Really super pretty. And then this one, I'm not sure if I held this one. Number 139, I feel like I did the number, the number screaming my name, but also this color is screaming my name. I feel like if I hold this color initially, I would have remembered. Okay, and then we have number 132. Okay, it's like a greeny gold. Another one that would be really, really great for Christmas time. And then, easy ombre powder. I wonder if this one is a white. Yeah, it's hard to say. It doesn't really look like a clear. It looks pigmented. But we'll see. I'll have to swatch this another day. Ooh, Christmas set white. Okay, sweet. Okay. Let's see what kind of glitters are in here. Okay, so I see some stars. Stars, snowflakes. Is that snowflakes? No, no snowflakes. Yeah, so I think this is the one that I actually wanted. Is that a snowflake? No, no, no. Yeah, snowflakes, snowflakes. Um, if you know me, you know I love anything with stars, but also this to me is like a perfect winter wonderland set. So happy to have that. So that is everything. Thank you so, so, so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this. If you did, I hope you'll give this, this video a thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below and let me know what the heck am I going to do with all of this stuff. Although it would be really nice to do a giveaway where I'm giving away to like 18 different people. That's going to be expensive in shipping and it's just not practical. So if you guys know a place that I could donate at least half of this stuff, um, I'll, I'll give a lot of it away to you guys because I know you're watching this video because you love nails and e-nail couture or you're just, I don't know, have nothing better to do. I don't know. Um, but yeah, if you guys can tell me something that you think would be a good idea that I can get this to people who might benefit from it um, while also giving some to my subscribers, I would really, really appreciate it. But anyways, until next time, and as always, have an amazing day. Bye.